see where that fuse goes? I put your explosives in there. We gotta get out of here. We'll be blown to bits. Who sent you here? Whose idea was it? Step on that fuse. Put it out. I will when you tell me what I want to know. Luca! Marty! Your friends can't help you now. Tell me who your boss is. I don't know. I was hired by a man I never saw before. Stop lying! Grab that piece of timber and break the door down. Hurry up! Break down that door! one of the guards in the control room fought the Green Hornet. DeLuca was knocked out in the struggle, but managed to delay the attackers until they were driven off by the arrival of the police. The Green Hornet again. Sure, if I could only lay my hands on the spout. Lucky for you, you can't, man of action. Besides, I don't think the Hornet had anything to do with it. Oh, you don't, eh? No. Remember, I wrote that story. So what? So I checked the facts, see? And there were half a dozen guards and several cops that saw the Hornet. Now, listen, Lowry, why would the Green Hornet want to sabotage Home Electric? Well, one reason might be is that they supply power to the Grayson Aluminum Works and several other places that are very important at the present time to the government. Well, I still don't believe it. The Green Hornet may be a bandit and a racketeer, but he's not a traitor. Yes. I'll send him right in. Mr. Reed wants you. Hmm. Why, I don't know. Did you talk with DeLuca? No, nope, by the time I got to his room and house, he'd taken a powder. Didn't you think it was odd that DeLuca disappeared? He's the man of the hour, the fellow who fought the Green Hornet and spoiled all his plans. Sure, that's just the reason why he scrammed. He knows the Hornet isn't going to forget that. Maybe you're right. Anyway, let's water over the dam. Look, I've just had a telegram from the Border Patrol. They say they're having trouble with aliens slipping over the line. I want you to take Axford and get me a feature story for the Sunday edition. Sure, I know. I should have finished the Hornet when he was down, but I thought that electric chili got it polished him off and I... We'll take care of the Hornet and get control of the home electric before we're through. In the meantime, you'll have to keep out of sight. When does the next shipment of rifles go down to the border? Tomorrow. Good. Put DeLuca on one of the trucks and get him over the line. Wait. Take Bardeen with you at the warehouse and show him how we operate this job. Hey, slow down, Axford. There's no hurry in getting back to the office with this Border Patrol story. It's for the Sunday edition, and I want to live to read it. I want to show you what the old crate will do. Crate is right. Egg crate. <laughs> You're getting chicken, are you? 
<laughs> now, I tell you, I had a supercharger put in, and the next time I see the car of the Green Hornet, I'll chase it up a tree. Yeah, you do your tree climbing on your own time. <laughs> Super instinct! He's on the wrong side! What's the idea of crowding us off the road? Keep your mouth shut if you want to stay out of jail. Hey, were you driving that crate, Halfwit? Control your tongue, me bucko, or I'll make you look worse than he does. If you'd been on your own side of the road, this would never have happened. Look at those wheel marks there if you want to see who was at fault. If the man's hurt, I'd take him to a doctor. Hey, Lowry, we better run this mug to the hospital. What's holding you up? Accident. What's going on here? Go on, clear out of this nosy before I bust you. You and how many more of your mob? What have you got in them bales? None of your business. Why? Hold it! Mike, hold it. One of your men is hurt. We were going to take him to a doctor. You're going to get moving in about one minute or you'll need more than a doctor. Oh, hold, it. Guys. hold it, hold it, Mike. Hold it. Okay, tough guy. But if the guy croaks, don't blame us. Come on, Mike. I'll let me poke him. Come on, I can knock the three of them. Ah, oh, and snakes, why didn't you let me bash them? Didn't you see that gun in his pocket? Another minute, you'd been shot full of holes. Come on, let's go. Ah, fooey. Did either one of them get a look at the other side of this bale? Look here. No, they didn't see it. Then no thanks to you. I got here just in time. What happened? They sideswiped us. DeLuca fell out when the truck hit the bank. Take it easy, Axford. Take it easy. You know, the fellow that got hurt looked familiar to me, but I, I can't place him. I didn't get a look at him. Hey, pull it over there and stop. I want to take another look at those guys. I'll take him back into town. Spike can go on with you. Put him in the car. Get your mood back on the truck and beat it. One of them's going back to town with the guy that's hurt. Let's follow him. smugglers into their lair, this would-be reporter wouldn't let me go in and drag them out by the scruff of their necks. I tell you, Reed, Lowry's gone soft on us. What makes you think they were smugglers? Well, they were mighty anxious to keep us from finding out what they were carrying. Where's the house where they went? A way out at the end of Fleming Street. Here's the address. Let me phone the cops and raid it up. Now, wait a minute. Lowry's right. You don't have any evidence against the men. You can't swear out a warrant just because you think they're crooks. But... Check on the place in the morning. Find out who the owner is and who the tenant is. That's all for now. But you... All right. Have you no bringing up your glow? Will you need me any more tonight, Mr. Britt? No, Cato. There doesn't seem to be anything more the Hornet can do about the home electric power plant raid. No, sir. Not unless you can locate the missing guard, Viruka. Ray! Reed! Yes? Now, oh, by golly, maybe you'll believe me. Here's a picture of one of them smugglers in the private rogues gallery. That's the fellow that was thrown on his head when we crashed the truck. And will you note that one of his aliases is DeLuca, the name of the guard that disappeared from the home electric power plant. Well, why didn't Lowry recognize DeLuca? He saw the man at the home electric plant. Yes, but he didn't see him at the truck accident. The mug was down on his face and Lowry was busy arguing. Maybe you've got something there, Michael. Take this down to Commissioner Brunson the first thing in the morning and tell him your story. He might make you a detective. <laughs> well, sure, he might do worse for the force. Good night, sir. Good night. Is that the man, Mr. Britt? Yes, that's DeLuca, all right. The Green Hornet has to talk to him before the police get to him. Get my mask and gun, Cato. Better they hadn't 
brought me here to your house. What's the matter with my house? Nothing, nothing. Only they should have brought me back to town with all those reporters looking for me. <laughs> That's right, because you're the hero of the home electric raid. Brave guard defense property. Lay off the ribbon, will you? <laughs> Gotta get out of here, I tell you. Ah, quit your beeping. There'll be more truckload of guns going over the border. Yeah, that's the trouble. The chief has enough rifles down there now to equip a whole regiment. Yeah, and he'll be wanting all we can ship to him, too. Hey, what? We meet again, don't we, Duluka? What do you want? I want information. Guns over the border, eh? Who's getting them? I don't know. They never tell us guys anything. Who doesn't tell you? Who gives you your orders? Guy calls himself Tower. I don't know what his real name is. Where do you get the guns? Look here, Hornet. What are you looking for, a split? No, Hornet doesn't take a split. He takes over. Now talk fast. All right. But you gotta give us guys a chance to get clear. A gang of killers. Of... I'm waiting. The rifles are out in the warehouse. 20 miles out on the Winslow Road. The Winslow Road. You fellows are going to take me out to that warehouse. Well, you can't go out there. The place is heavily guarded. They'd kill all of us. That's a chance we have to take. Here, five his hands behind his back. Make it tight. So, oh, get the other cord. First place you can phone the police. Tell them to pick up a man I left in that cottage. A crowing. What's wrong? Where's DeLuca? The Green Hornet. He's got DeLuca. They've gone to the warehouse. We've got to tell Krogan. Come on. Please. This way. We should have that stuff out of the warehouse by the end of the week. Yeah, Tonches is flying another load of explosives across the border tonight. Yes? What's that? Yes, the Green Hornet. He's on his way to the warehouse now with DeLuca, a prisoner. Yeah, we had a narrow escape. Got out of McCoy's house just before the police arrived. All right, I'll take care of it. Trouble? Plenty. The Hornet's got to Luca and is on his way to the warehouse. Some way the police are in on it. Well, the Hornet wouldn't work with the police. Not directly. But if he could wreck the syndicate's plans with a tip, he'd certainly give it. Tonji's must be in the air by now. He left the warehouse 20 minutes ago. He'll have to turn back. The warehouse must be destroyed before the Hornet or the police arrive. Get him on the radio. Calling CR4. Calling CR4. Hello? Krogan speaking. CR4. We're going to destroy the warehouse. Set the beacon light and get the men out of there. Calling CR4. Yes, at once. Calling I'm CR4. calling Tanji's back. Calling CR4. Calling CR4. CR4 answering. Go ahead. Tanji's. Krogan speaking. We're going to destroy the warehouse. Turn back and drop a bomb on it. The beacon light will be set and the men clear in ten minutes. Okay, Chief. What 
that light for? That's the guy to fly us so they can make a landing. I tell you, we can't go in that warehouse. They'll shoot you down. You're going ahead of me. They'll know you. But they shoot a dozen like me down in order they could kill the Green Hornet. Get going. What about the guards? Where are they? I don't know. There's something wrong. They must be watching us. Let's get away from here while we can. Hold it, Toluca. That trick won't work. Get inside. Do all these cases contain explosives? Yeah, there's tons of us. Grenades and shells. Where does that door lead to? Oh, that leads to the basement. There's nothing down there. Please make the landing now. You better get out of here while you can. 